Today, we are going to be writing the formula for the ionic compound, calcium acetate. So let's start from left to right. I see that I have calcium. I scan where calcium is on the periodic table, right? And I see that calcium is right here. Calcium is represented by Ca, and it's always in group two, so it has a plus two charge. Now here's a trick, guys. Acetate, if it ends in an ATE, it's always a polyatomic ion. It's not gonna be found on the periodic table, so you gotta memorize those. So I just wrote it down what we're gonna see here. Acetate is C2H3O2 with the negative one charge. So C2H3O2 with a negative one charge. Now, since we have those charges, we're just gonna crisscross them to say how many of each component I need in my formula. So this plus two crisscrosses down, telling me that I need two acetates, and this negative one crisscrosses down, telling me that I need one calcium. Now all I gotta do is just put them together. So I'm gonna start with my calcium. I have Ca, and I only need one of them, Technically, we don't really write the runs. We, we don't really write the ones. Say that 15 times fast. But here's the catch, guys. If you have multiple amounts of a polyatomic ion, which is what we have here, I do need parentheses. So I need to put in parentheses C2H3O2 and then close them and then say I have two of them. And that is your final answer. So... Calcium acetate is just Ca, C2H3O2, 2. Thank you so much for reviewing the video. I really hope this helped. Let me know in the comments, okay? Subscribe to the channel if you want to help us out, and I really hope you're having a great day, okay? Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.